Naughty Gang, Naughty Gang, Naughty Gang. It's MLB season. Shout out to everybody that's been rocking with me since MLB The Show 21. This is MLB The Show 22, how to go from zero to a million stubs. I'm gonna be showing you guys all the tips, methods, and strategies in order to flip on the market, how to invest in players to make more profit, and how to overall take advantage of all the free opportunities in the game. If you're new to the channel, drop a thumbs up on the video. If you are OG MVP, go in the comment section right now and say MVP and let's get this banger going. If you're looking for a super, super fun and easy way to earn extra money, follow me on Underdog Fantasy and use code Fat Dollars for a deposit bonus up to a hundred bucks. All you got to do is come in here, make one dollar bets, two dollar bets, three dollar bets. It don't matter. Choose your players. Come over to the right, put the amount in. One dollar bet, you have a chance to win three dollars back. I will be giving you guys free picks. Follow me on my Twitter and I will give you a Discord link and let's have some fun. All right, so the first thing you want to do is when you open your pre-order packs or if you just get the standard edition, make sure that you save every single card over a 83 overall. 82 overalls and below, you can't get rid of them. Stubs are very important this year. Now, before we get into investing, you want to make sure that you have about 80 to 100,000 stubs in your pocket okay now it's a lot of ways right now early in the game to make stubs but once the official launch comes out a lot of the cars that are going for seven thousand eight thousand stubs will inflate a lot of the higher tier cards will inflate just like we saw last year now an easy way to make stubs right now is the mini seasons. If you go look at the mini seasons, the rewards, you're going to get a free 89 overall diamond Evan Longoria right here. All total, you're also going to get another 34,000 XP just by playing the game, completing all these missions. You're also going to get about 20 to 22 thousand stubs just from playing the game and then you're also going to get 25 plus show packs and that's if you win the championship also all these are versus the cpu so if you are new to the game or if you have trouble with the game it's on a low difficulty just be patient at the plate and take advantage of these free stub and free pack opportunities you can get lucky Pull a Mike Trout who's going for over 450,000 stubs early in the game. After you do all these free missions, the mini seasons, the conquests, you should be having about 125 to 250,000 stubs, give or take or depending on how many diamond pools you get. Now in this championship bundle, right here you can see you get 15 The Show packs. Each one of them packs have about five to 50,000 stub value in them. And you're gonna be getting 25 of these, okay? Now, this is repeatable. If you don't wanna go online, which I won't do until I get a full diamond squad, you can do this over and over and over. Each game is three innings. So it's very easy, very fast, and a good way to get your team up and running. Now, another good way to make stubs and a way to get your team up is the conquest so if you come right here to the nation of baseball this one is going to take more time but you're going to get show packs and you're going to get a diamond at the end that's the biggest one you're going to get an 88 overall mike piazza that's going to be your bet catcher for a while you're going to get an 86 overall an 85 overall and then you're going to get another 15 to 20 show packs and it might be hidden rewards in the map okay and this is repeatable now remember last year last year when they had certain cards like the prospects and the golds and all that you're going to be getting them for free in the game make sure that you don't lock them in right away because as you seen last year later on down the road those cards were needed and if you didn't want to complete a certain collection you could sell them for triple profit stubs is super super good one key to remember 
yesterday's value is not today's value. So once the game launches, a card that you've seen that day is not gonna be the same value four to five days after launch. So some cards will go down, some cards will rise up. As you can see, last year, Mike Trout was about 350, 400,000 stubs. He shot all the way up another 100,000 stubs. The Jacob DeGrom shot up about another 100, 120,000 stubs. Acuna, and so on and so forth. So I'm going to be playing the mini seasons in the Conquest. That's going to be the first thing that I do. Once I get these all the way completed, get all the free packs possible, then I'm going to worry about what I'm going to do with my stub count. So as you can see right here, doing my pre-order packs, I did pull an 88 Corbin Burns and I also pulled an 86 Max Muncy. So I have about 35,000 stubs in the stash. So that'll put me close to 50,000 stubs. I just started the mini seasons. Okay. So I got my first game in the mini seasons done. I'm going to game number two. After I complete these mini seasons, that should get me another 60 to 70,000 stubs. I'll be close to that 100,000 stub mark. And then I will go into conquest, get the XP for those. And that's going to help you with the face of the franchise. So when you come down here to programs, face of the franchise, you're going to complete these with the XP. So like I said earlier, from the mini seasons, you're going to get about 34,000 XP. That will put you close to this show pack already now just playing the game you're going to be getting more and more xp so that will put you up further you're going to be getting flashbacks you're going to be getting legends all these golds right here have pretty decent value and before you know it you're going to be unlocking these big cards with the 90 overall sellable diamonds okay so just by playing the game don't rush to go online i know a lot of people want to go online and play but getting your stubs for investments later on is super, super important. Once you get to that 100,000 mark, then you can hit up that marketplace and we will have videos on what items to go for the best flips and the best profit. It's MLB season, baby. Drop a thumbs up on the video and I'll see y'all in 24 hours. Make sure that y'all follow me on all socials, my Twitter and everything is down in the link in the description. And if you want to play Underdog Fantasy, I give out free picks. I have a Discord for MLB The Show 22, Stub Methods. So follow me on Twitter. I will give you the Discord link and we can hook it up all day. Let's go.